Yep. Hey, it's me, Yub, and clap it up. You survived 2020. Great job. Every year on this channel, I do this tube buddy year in review thing. Like, it's kind of dorky, but it's fun for me, and I get to talk at you for a little bit. A little more serious. Not really. It's not. It's not. And we're about to do that, but before we get underway with the 2020 year in review, something just doesn't feel right, does it? You feel that? New year, new cut. Look at this one! You look like Bobby from All right, look. Yeah, big giant haircut. I understand. How could I do this to you? You trusted me. Me talking about my haircut is not the entire point of this video. All I'll say is everyone should be able to do what they want with their own hair. And I believe in that. I've seen a lot of people online who have said, like, yeah, but I grew my hair out because of you. You should grow your hair out because you want to. Not because of me. Do what you want. Anyways, 2020 year in review. Now, keep in mind, we're only looking at my YouTube channel in 2020, not 2020 just as a year, because I think we all understand that, like, that sucked. It's always so fun for me to look at this year in review because it's gone. I've done it for like several years in a row, and it's gone from always Undertale everything being the top to now. Honestly, I will be surprised if there's an Undertale video in the top three. I really will. Knock on wood. Come on, guys. Let's take a look at the pile of crap I made this, this year. Year, 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 year. How did y'all channel perform in 2020? <laughs> Let's find out. Click to start. Ooh, I'm going to have to change that. Start it up. And it's got that same inspiring song. Let's go back. <laughs> yeah, just erase this whole year if you wanted. How you began 2020? 510,000. Okay. Nice. Top three uploads. This game is crap. And we're going to go back and look at this stuff. Lomando is number two. What's number one, though? Yeet the baby. I am so pleased with these three top. I honestly swear to God, did not know. Subscribers gained 213K. Okay. Videos uploaded less. It's like less videos uploaded every year. What the heck? How you're ending the year. 723. And an office gift. I'm here for this. Let's face it. 2020 has been a tough year. Through it all, video has helped us bring together and unite us as a community. We believe it's more important than ever to take a moment to celebrate you and everything you've been able to accomplish this year. We are so proud of the entire two but I could just stop. Honestly, I should stop that. 2020, man, what a year. Didn't know there'd be so much to fear in here. Good thing we're clear. 2021 should be kind of fun. Have a vaccine for everyone, we hope. Coronavirus will be a joke, we hope. Okay, so let's scroll up. I'm gonna look at this stuff. We're gonna talk about this stuff, and then we could just talk about me because that's what I like to. I'm just kidding. Let's talk about you. How you feeling? See, this doesn't work. Okay, so we began with 510,000. I remember it being such a big deal. Right at the new year, I hit 500,000. It was amazing. And I was like, million this year, a million? Top three uploads. It, listen, when I made all three of these, I did not think they were going to do well. And it was my top three videos of the year. Are you freaking serious? Okay, this game is crap. He he. Let's go to it. Brow, brow. Hey, it's me. Yo oh, wow. See, you know what sucks? <laughs> it's when you, when you sit down to make a video. You usually don't think that that video is going to be one of your top three of a year and definitely didn't think 810,000 people were going to watch it. If I had, I wouldn't have worn my hair like this. Up, and those of you who know me, what is going? Look at this little bun back. What's going on here? So this is that weird, um, like Japanese mom hid my game game. There are more of these games that I've been putting off playing. Look at this guy right here. <laughs> There's more of these. I'm happy to play them. Leave a comment if you want me to. The guy has, the guy who made these has made like 15 games. We got Lomondo. I cannot believe over a million views. Bah, bah, bah. You know what's weird is I literally had no idea. Genuinely had no freaking clue that this video was over a million views. How did I? I, I wanna, I'm going to go back to Lomondo.com. What did I look like in this one? Hey, that's at least normal. Was I supposed to click on that head that fell by, you think? It's, 
All right, well, so there's Lomondo. That was good. And I cannot, literally, my mind is blown. Almost 2 million views. Hey, wait a minute. Yeet the baby? It's so random, but I want to point something out, okay? This one and this one. Horror games. Are horror games back on my channel? I stuck it out and played horror games so long that you're now old enough to like it. You were nine when you got here. I understand you're 11 now. You're ready to watch some scary games. Performance versus last year. Now this is interesting because less videos, by 12% less videos, views gained way up, over 60% over in views. That's amazing. And then the subscribers, it's kind of slow. That's what I was saying. Like my subscriber growth has always been kind of slow. I have a theory that it's because I don't ask people to subscribe. I'm not one of these people that's like, yo, what's up? Welcome to today's video, dude. Before we jump in, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can worship me. I figure like people will subscribe if they are picking up what you're putting down. If they like what you're putting out, they'll subscribe. So I've always kind of subscribed to that theory. I am doing okay. But this is like not a big growth. From 2019 to 2020, I gained 200,000 and roughly 200,000. It's like not really that big of a deal. But the views, this is what I really care about. Not subscribers. I care about the views. Very good. I'm so pleased with this number right here. Listen, 2014 Yub putting out his first gameplay video did not think this could happen. That could be you. Just, I don't know who needs to hear this, but it's time to start making the videos you've been thinking about instead of just thinking about it. And we're ending the year, 723,233 million views and two, we're almost at 3,000 uploads. I need to do something, something special. To be honest with you guys, I'm kind of fine with having slightly less videos uploaded. I think it's one thing I've learned and that is my new year's resolution. Oh, I don't want to spoil it. So going into 2021, what are my predictions for the Yub channel? Uh, number one, everybody will be pissed about the haircut. That's fine. I think 2021 will be the year I break a million subs and I'm going to try my very best to make that happen. I don't know how to make it happen. I want to hit it like halfway through, like July. I want to be a million plus in July. I also think this is kind of a dumb prediction, but stick with me. I think 2021 will be the year that I switch over from being like right now. I always see the comments. Oh, you're such an underrated YouTuber. You're why do more people not know about you? As we get closer to a million subs, it's gonna flip flop and it's gonna be like overrated. You know what I mean? Like he's trying too hard, like the singing stuff, the rapping stuff. It's not, it's gonna go from charming and quirky to like, I am overrated and people hate me. And I understand that that's just how the pendulum of popularity swings, but that's just my prediction is there's gonna be a shift in the narrative. Good thing I ain't gonna see it cause I don't read the comments. I do read the comments, just not as much as I used to. As your channel gets bigger, you kind of got to stop reading the comments. If you're somebody like me who uses comments to like as actual feedback and I use the comments to like make my channel better. If I try to do everything that people say in my comments, I would have killed myself because they told me to. Uh, <laughs> all I'm saying is as your channel gets way bigger, you got to read the comments way less. It's just like that. It sucks, but this is how it is. For my own mental health, I have to. New Year's resolutions. Can I do like a notepad? Yeah, this is nice because then I don't have to edit text on the screen. <laughs> New Year's resolutions for me. I'm yeah, by the way. Number one, more music content. Whether that is me releasing an actual song, like a social cues song, <laughs> social cues on Spotify, check it out. Or just more videos like my automaton video, like just music related things. It could cross over with gameplay, that's fine. I just love music and I've been scared to break more into that scene on YouTube because you have to be really good at music on YouTube. And I feel like I don't care anymore. So I want to do more music content. I'm not saying I'm becoming a music channel. I'm just saying do more, do more. Number two, this doesn't really pertain to the channel, but it kind of does be in better shape. I mean, physically, especially now that I cut my hair back how I had it like two years ago, you can really tell the difference in the, just the shape of my, my face. When I started working from home, is when I really realized you have to actually eat good. And I don't, I eat really bad. Number three, don't stress the upload schedule. And as you saw in the numbers, I've already started that this last year. It's not because I'm lazy. I mean, I had, I literally had a baby in 2020. So the fact that I even got in the same ballpark with uploads 
is amazing. Let me tell you, it is amazing. Trust me. I know it's amazing. Like last year, one of my resolutions was family first. And I way, I definitely stuck to that. I'm not so much talking about family with this. I'm talking about learning that if I don't get that video out today, my channel's not going to flop. It'll, you'll still be here tomorrow. Now, if it becomes a problem and I'm having problem getting videos out, obviously that is not good. What I'm talking about is literally what I'm doing today, which is that yesterday I did the whole, I did the haircut thing, right? I spun in the circle. And then I was like, when I get back from my haircut, I'll sit down and make the rest of that video. I didn't feel like it. I wanted to spend time because it was like 4 PM when I got back. I wanted to spend time with Meg. I wanted to spend time with the baby. And you know what? I did it. And you're still here. And is, did my channel get deleted? Oh, it got deleted. Okay. Yep, none of this matters. Okay, so yeah, I don't want to make a ton of resolutions. I like to stick around three. These are mine. What are your New Year's resolutions? Check the comments where you left it to see your own resolution. That makes no sense. Oh, secret number four, finish some games. <laughs> so sorry, I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't finish games. I've had an idea for a while of like a stream series because a lot of the reason I don't finish games is because they're doing badly and I need to pay my bills, right? And so if it's getting low views, I kind of have to think about discontinuing the series. I say we do a stream series. I stream every Thursday, by the way, 3.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. Oh, it's Thursday. No, I wanted to upload this today. Uh-oh. Maybe I'll stream. I'll stream Friday. I'm going to stream tomorrow. Forget it. I say we do a stream series where I finish some unfinished games because on a stream, it doesn't even matter. It, it does not matter. You're just hanging out. So anyways, those are my resolutions, gamers. What are you? Also, how do you now feel about my physical appearance? Leave it in the comments as you know, I, it's the only way I know how you feel. If you don't tell me that you hate my haircut in the comments, well, gosh darn it, I'm never gonna know. All right, guys. Well, I don't like to make these too long. This was the Yub 2020 year in review. Yeah. If you want to submit some new uh, icons on the Yub Reddit, be my freaking guest, dog. All right, guys. Well, here is to yet another year on YouTube. Thank you. If you're someone who's been here with me since the very start, why don't you just leave it in the comments? Let me know how long you've been here. And if you plan to be here for 2021, please don't leave me, please. I'm sorry I cut my hair. Please do not leave. You guys are the freaking best and I love you so much. Thank you for watching my year in review and being here all year if you were. If you just got here, that's fine too. Patreon supporters, the financial support every month, actually insane. Thank you so much. Keep in mind also that these Patreon supporters do this basically in exchange for nothing other than getting their name on the screen because I'm one of the worst people to support on Patreon. You get nothing in exchange. Really, you don't get anything. All right, guys, I got to go edit this video now. I'll see you in the next one. Make sure you keep that chin up, work hard, and believe in yourselves. And as always, have a bye five. My outro song is kind of lame. I'm just so sick of the copyright claim. So I wrote this song. It'll do all right. If you have a spare second, could you smack the like button? Smack the like button. I secretly wanted to do the haircut and just never acknowledge it and make it a meme. I should have done that. Dang it.